What up, YouTube? Bro, phone back for another video on this glorious, beautiful day, y'all. It don't get no better. It's not hot. It's got a slight overcast to it. It's perfect. I don't know how else to put it. All right, but I got a problem, y'all. Now, uh, I got strawberry plants back there, and they're growing good. But I can't get the snails out. They keep eating up all my strawberries and, and making a real problem. So, I have been putting uh, little beer traps, you know, little lid full of beer. But what happens is it rains and I have to keep replacing it. So, I went on Amazon and bam, I have a beer trap snail catcher. How about that? Ain't that cool? Cool thing about it is the this will hold the uh, alcohol, whatever alcohol. You probably read the uh, title, so you know what kind of alcohol I'm using. It's the cheap kind. You got a little housing, and the big deal about it is you don't have to change it as often because the water doesn't get in there and dilute your beer out. So this keeps the water out. Snail come in there, they die. You just dump it. You dump it once a week, put some more beer in there. So I'm doing a lot of talking about it. How about I do some demonstration? So these are strawberry plants in question. Oh, and by the way, it's gonna be malt liquor. It's cheap and I'm thinking that it's stronger so it attract the more. You know, I'm not uh, advertising malt liquor in the 45. But I was never sure exactly what that meant, so I got some. Found out for myself. Thing, I'm definitely not gonna drink this, y'all. Definitely not gonna drink this. So the first thing I'm gonna do is dig a hole, cause I want it kind of at ground level. And I leave it just like that. Step two, pop the top, baby. Woo! Snails like tender plant growth, making your developing garden a prime target. While the damage they cause to the tender growth is obvious, few people are aware that snails also eat plant roots, stems, and fruit, earthworms, and fungi. And put the top on it. It's literally that simple. Now I'm gonna do a couple more of them because I got a lot of snails around here. So do the same thing over here. Strawberry plant. Hope it ain't dead. We'll put it somewhere. New real estate. But pull this out. I want it kind of close to ground level so they don't have to crawl in it. They just crawl over it. They thirst, I got something for you. Snail, I got something for you. But this ain't the only place that I have a problem with snail. So I'm gonna set up the trap in a couple more places. All right, this right by my watermelon patch, so I'm gonna be a little proactive. And I'm not gonna dig it in the ground because if they if snails can climb into my container, they can climb in this bowl, get some of this cool, refreshing drink. It's a hot day too. Of course snails want a cold bill. So I'm just going to place this here. Give it a little shade so it'll stay cold longer. Come and get it, y'all. Right there. I'm going to put it in between some more of my plants. It's another watermelon and some tomato. So I think the snails want the uh, watermelon a whole lot more than they want the tomatoes. So I'm going to put it here in case they change their mind, trying to go vegan or whatever they're trying to do. Ugh. 
Come and get it, y'all. One more spot. Right. There's one more place I want to put it. But, look at that good, dark dirt. Oh, my goodness. This is the one of my raised beds. I'm not going to put it in all my raised beds because I really don't have plants that I think they want. But I'm just going to put it here and give them an opportunity to get them a cold, refreshing... Put the top on it, and they ready. They in the upper room, upper room. You know I'm fighting pests. I'm fighting bugs. I want all my food. So y'all let me know what y'all doing in the comments. Right down there below this video in the comments. Let me know what y'all doing to deal with snails, pests. Let me know all the good stuff I can do to keep this stuff out my garden so I can keep growing good. If y'all enjoyed this video, hit the like button. If you didn't, still hit the like button because you watched it this far. Really? Really?